It's senior night at all seasons for a rivalry matchup between Niqua Valley and the Warriors Hockey Club. Back in December, the Wildcats won this matchup in a dominating 3-0 fashion. Starting this game late in the first period, Finnegan O'Toole gets the puck at the point and his shot through traffic is soaked up by Aiden Wysoglad. Niqua looking for one last chance in the first. Trenton Fisk skates in over the blue line and shoots on net, but his wrist shot is kicked away by Jack Poitamani. We go into the second period scoreless. The Warriors start the second period on the front foot. Evan Ziegler stick handles his way past a defender, but his effort is shut down by Why So Glad. Green and Gold continue the pressure. This time it's Owen Cope with a chance on net, but once again the Warriors can't get past Why So Glad. Just under 6 minutes to play in the second period as Dylan McRae carries the puck in and shoots high glove side giving the Wildcats a 1-0 lead going into the third period. We start the third period with a board battle. Coming up with the puck is Matt Allman who passes off to Owen Cope but his shot is fought off by Aiden Wysoglad and cleared by the Nikwa defense. 9 minutes to play and Nikwa has a power play. Chase Rosenberg has a shot from the blue line that is kicked aside by Poitamani, but there to score on the rebound is Dylan McRae, who puts the Wildcats up by two. Two minutes later, and it's the Warriors' turn on the power play. Evan Ziegler gets the puck in the right circle and check out his stick handling to beat Why So Glad and cut the lead in half. However, just a minute later, Sahil Berry carries the puck into the zone and his shot gets past Poitamani and just barely crosses the line. Nikwa leads 3-1 with 6 minutes to play. Empty net now for the Warriors. The first shot from the point is dealt with by Wysoglad, but the rebound falls to Joe Pianowski who shoots bar down. Warriors trail by 1 with 2.54 to play. Dying seconds of the game as Pianowski tries to throw a puck out in front, but Sahil Berry makes the block as time expires. For the second time this season, Nikwa Valley takes down the Warriors Hockey Club, this time by a score of 3-2. Oh, it feels amazing, just the energy that we get in the locker room is just amazing, and just being there with my teammates, being celebrated with my teammates after scoring, it just feels amazing. Pure excitement, uh, the energy is just so high. We're so excited to go into state and playoffs and this league. Um, Excited that we're in first place now in this league and just ready to keep going. Uh, it feels amazing. Like uh, I can't even really describe how I feel. I like our, all of our guys are so like we're so excited. It's like we played them for senior night the past I don't know like three five, four years. Never won one until now, uh, and now we're back to back both two games and winning in a row with them. So it feels amazing.